Hello, everybody. Andrea Majeski here with Dental L. So I just thought that I would check in to make sure that everybody's doing okay because it's been a couple weeks now since we had started the course. And I apologize, my puppies are playing right now and apparently they're making a lot of noise. So sorry about that. But um, yes, yeah, so it's been a couple weeks and um, just to clarify, so keep in mind that per each module and, and um, each PowerPoint, I don't expect all of you guys to get through each PowerPoint, say, say a day or even a week. It just depends on how quickly you want to study. But at the same time, you know, take your time. If you have time, take your time. That is okay. But once everything is done and once everything is uploaded, if you were in a hurry per se, it should take you about um, eight weeks eight weeks. It can take you less time. It can take you more time. It just depends on how many hours per day you want to study each module and then each topic in, um, inside that too. So I do say that if you can study at least two hours every single day, you will be able to get through everything. But if you're able to study, say, up to six hours per day, um, I don't suggest studying more than six hours every single day because you're brain can only retain so much. So as an example, if you have a full-time job, studying six hours a day is pretty impossible. I mean, not impossible, but I don't want you guys to be waking up at two in the morning, you know, either to get your studying in and then having to stay up till midnight to get your studying in at night. So think if you have a full-time job, you'll probably be, be able to barely get your two hours a day in if you do have to work. If you have a day off, then I do say to study upwards to six hours because then that will help you sort of catch up on everything else. So I do have a module in um, module one in there now. As I said, I do say that this will take you approximately two weeks to study for module one. It could take you more. It could take you less. That is okay. But look through all of the topics first and then take the mock exam afterwards. Now, some people like to take the mock exams at the very end, and that is you know, totally um, up to you, but some also like to take um, a mock exam after each module based on those topics, so that is totally up to you. So I have module one down there with the mock exam, Module two is now in there and then the mock exam is coming by tomorrow. So keep on checking back. Um, and then module three, you will have that all in there by November the 7th. So I don't like to upload everything right away because then I find students, you know, they get overwhelmed easier and they're like, well, like there's just too much to study here. Like, where do I start first? So if you're coming into the course when everything's in there, that is still okay. But I do highly suggest looking through module one, taking your time. So topic per topic, module two, you know, and then module three after that. So good luck. If you need any help, please let me know. And I will talk to you all very, very soon.